All right, and here we go. What is up, guys? This is the Average Johnny coming back to you with yet another average video, and today we're gonna do something really exciting for me, at least. I don't give a fuck about the rest of you. I'm totally kidding. You know I love you guys. <laughs> I'm a total goof. I'm sorry. Okay, well, okay. So what I wanted to do today is I finally wanted to get started on a, a gameplay of a game that I'm very excited about. Uh, destroy all humans and for two reasons one i love the game without without a doubt i love the game i've talked about it i've discussed it in past videos and of course um and of course uh we have the remake that is going to come out sometime in in either early 2020 or within the second quarter of 2020 so i am super looking forward to that i'm definitely getting the collector's edition that's going to come with it not the freaking 400 dollar one screw that one i'm getting the one that's reasonable at 150 dollars so that's the one I'm going to be aiming for, and right now I just wanted to go uh, take a trip back down memory lane and play this game along with you guys. This is something that I'm definitely going to look forward to, so uh, let's take a look at it. First of all, let's do this first. You guys see this layout, this little layout that we have all around here? Yeah, it's time for a change. Boom. New layout, <laughs> new average Johnny. I don't know if you guys have checked in the in the channel art already. The channel art has changed as well. I might change the official logo that I have on my channel. I don't know if I want to do that just yet. So we're just going to have to wait and see. Um, I'm going to start a completely new game. Just look how long ago I played this game. 2017 is the last time I played this. And nowhere near complete because all I did was the missions. And I'm probably just going to do the same thing as well here. So you know what? Let's do this, you guys. This is going to be... <laughs> We're going to have an amazing time. Such an amazing game. So many memories. Again, played it uh, on the PS2 days. And I am super stoked about the remake that is going to come to us soon. I cannot wait. Honestly, I cannot wait. So, just double checking to make sure that everything's good. Keep it quiet. Raise the volume just a little bit for now. Contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars. Yep, destroy all humans. I hope you guys love this game as much as I do. Because I hella love it. This is, of course, on the PS4. However, this is the, the just the straight PS2 to PS4 port uh, version of the game. So there's nothing special about it. Graphics are still PS2 level, so... Keep that in mind. So just, let's just watch as this thing goes on. Oh, God, so awesome, man. Such aw such awesomeness. <laughs> I cannot get over it. I will send a quick text message as this little cutscene continues to play out. go it's awesome man just awesome oh lord imagine just imagine well you know what we can say that this probably did happen and they just don't want to tell us are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. I hope you guys recognize this voice. <laughs> Let me God. get this straight. I love this voice so much. Crypto-136 to a hostile planet, and he's disappeared. Maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie. 
But there's a time for thought, and there's a time for action, and this is one of those times. Which? The second one. <laughs> the humor, man. Cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys. We gotta go in. We gotta crack some graniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta. I gotta. Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? <laughs> <laughs> My god, man. I love the personality of the fucking crypto, man. It's hilarious. That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy destination the planet Earth. awesome dude awesome simply awesome here we go man let's go for it straight to the hangar 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 <laughs> okay mm -hmm. I've always loved these transitions let me lower the volume back down Yeah, man, that's amazing. If you guys don't recognize that voice uh, of Pox, that is uh, Invader Zim, as most people will know it. And uh, another additional many are going to recognize him as Billy from Billy and Mandy. What a freaking voice to use for that character. Hilarious, man. <laughs> this is going to be awesome, man. Watching the remake, I cannot wait to play the remake. I really hope to see some new stuff in there, but this is, um, if it's just a simple, like, remaster, I honestly would not mind at all. Even if it was just that. <laughs> but I know for a fact THQ Nordic would not do that. Of course, in addition to that, people are excited about the Spongebob remake. A lot of people are mentioning it to me, and I actually... Come in, Cryptosporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto, to ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovines, bovines. are likely candidates. candidates. Surely you don't mean. I love these lines. Now. Smelling gas bags beyond the fence. Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. No, <laughs> Cryptosporidium. I love how he calls him by his full name. Cryptosporidium. Oh, cortex scan. L1, X button. The right analog stick. You can move about the area using the left analog stick. Eat with their mouths. Uh, I think I'm going to be violently ill. Attention, Earth creature. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. It always cracked me up that he's talking to a cow like this. At this expecting time, him to be to abduct you for the purpose of scientific cooperative. research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? Oh my god. Come on, Crypto. You're smarter than Earth this. Creature, I am addressing you. Respond or be vaporized. I don't care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. <laughs> oh my god. How could you not hate this game? How could you hate this game, I mean? <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. We had to kill cows, man. Hold L1 button, then hurl the bovines by double tapping triangle button. Remember when games were so specific, they would say the triangle button, the square button, the analog stick. Nowadays, I guess because there's so many ports, they don't do it as often. At least we don't hear it as often. Oh, what are you doing? Concentration meter. Oh, right, 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 right. I already killed him. I just had to tip him over. But it's more fun pushing him. Sorry. It's a video game, alright guys? Don't be reporting PETA on me. <laughs> mm, Martha, 
you tell me we's having barbecue for dinner? Wait a minute. That ain't steak. That's holy mother Martha. Give me the shotgun. Ooh. Now what? Attention. You do in fact have weapons. Just hold the R1 button. Try it now. Give that puny farmer a taste it's of It's funny just to fly around. I know you can't kill me. It's easy to kill this guy. There. Already dead. And of course, this whole thing. That's like... The cool thing is that in the remake, they take off those screens that are kind of interruptive to me, in my opinion. Which I think was really good. So that's going to be a good thing to see. green he is not green he is in fact he looks more like grayish to me i don't know where people get green from all right so he obviously called what the hell how is this farmer back up oh wait never mind they all just look the same i thought the same one just got revived or something i totally forgot that they all look the same all right let's get the other farmer There you go, you varmint. <laughs> there's nothing more hilarious than tossing people in the water, man. Like, there is just nothing funnier than that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you little snitch. Go talk to the police. Hey, turnip seed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. What is that? A new silo? I don't think <laughs> I don't think aliens would be that dumb to leave their saucers out like that. Unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. Exactly. Those brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor. They could rip a hole in the space-time continuum. Yep, let's not let that happen. Let's go. The inquisitive authorities. I love Pox's like authoritative voice. It's freaking hilarious, man. Oh, I killed the lady. Sorry. I didn't mean that. You. Oh, crap. Okay, poor lady. I'm not over here. I'm just screwing with her. Get out of here. He could go ahead and die. That voice, man. It's just like so like... <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. It's different. Hurry up. Get up. Get up. Destroying all humans, man. Let's do it. Use your left analog stick to propel the saucer forward. Right. This is what. This is the other thing that people were upset about. Um. In this game, you cannot levitate up or down. In the remake, you most certainly can. Which was uh, something that I'm really gonna look forward to. Something that kind of sucked, you know, that you can't really do that. So, yeah. Okay. Let's just hurry up and kill this, this thing off. How long have we been running? We've been running for 13 minutes. That's fine. I can go for a 20-minute video. Alright. Oh, lordy lord. These guys. This is going to be interesting. industrial complex we can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence exterminate them now open fire holy shit all right oh there you go military when's uh right wait 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 the only way to repair the hole is to find a repair pod <laughs> Uh, okay. Look out. There are more to the north in the bushes. Where? Let me see them. Let me see him. Let me see him. The humans are making a final push. Whoa. Wipe them out once and for all. Oh, okay. Okay. Look at that. We can just drag him around too, man. <laughs> How does that not destroy them?
Oh well, I basically just kidnapped them. There's some exclamation marks that basically is telling me that somebody was a witness and they saw stuff. So therefore, you could either kill them or let them live. In this case, well, okay. One of the best lines in this game. Honestly, love this part. <laughs> it's freaking hilarious. Did you see, you see what, what I, I see? You bet bet your sweet ass, ass I did. What'd you see? <laughs> My God, man, these guys are so goofy. Right. Good. Me too. Not gray. Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? It means the papers got it right. So what actually kind of sucks about the um the remake is that it actually looks quite different. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. Like rather than looking like that, they look a lot more cartoony in the remake, which for me is kind of debatable whether it's good or not. I mean, it would fit the whole theme that this whole game is supposed to be like loony and weird and stuff, but I still think that there is a there is extra humor when you add serious looking characters. You know, the fact that these uh these guys look super serious is what kind of adds to the humor. And I think just making them look goofy on purpose is kind of killing that. So yeah, I don't know. Um, collect 200, 240 DNA. What? To unlock the next mission. So that means I have to land the saucer? Okay. Alright, This so this is the part where they kind of get you like free roaming and all that. And I guess this is a good time to show you guys uh, what it's like to pursue things on foot. So that should be a little fun. Uh, so let's do this. Look at all this stuff we have to do now. Anal probe. Oh lord. Hiccups. A bunch of Marthas apparently in this town. Oh, anal probe. Was that an anal probe? I don't think that was the anal probe. Oh, that's the anal probe. Watch this, you guys. This is hilarious. Oh, what? I didn't get him. Oh, I think I have to get him from behind. I think I have to get him from behind. I don't think that works. That's weird. Alright, fuck it. We'll zap them both. Look how they fly in the air. <laughs> oh my goodness. So yeah, we have to get all this DNA apparently. Great. So much DNA. What about this guy? No, not him. There we go. Extracting the brains. How about this scarecrow? I wonder if I could kill him. No, I could only throw him. All right, what's this? Turn, start turnip, turnip seed terror. I think it's like a bonus thing, I guess. <sighs> awesome. Oh, right. Those things are like, a okay. Those things provide extra DNA, which is cool. Oh God. Sorry, you guys. You know what? I'm gonna scan it first. Yeah, you could straight animal cruelty in this game. <laughs> I don't mean to offend anybody, so, you know, that's- it's part of the game, I'm sorry. And in some cruel way, I find it to be hilarious sometimes. And I don't mean to be that way. I'm- I'm a twisted child. I was a twisted child. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Check this out. You know, pro. It doesn't work. I think- do they have to be dead? I forget. There we go. Check that out. Anal probe. Where the hell is he going? Where the hell is he? I lost him. You just had to be hiding in that damn tree, you little shit. 
Could you probe a chicken? No, you can't probe a chicken. All right. Oh, you have to hold it. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can find any of those additional DNAs. I know I saw one a bit earlier. You know, this, it's cool. You have like all these bonus missions that you could do. This is what it seems like. Ooh, there we go. Completely caught off guard. Anal pro for you too. There we go. Another anal probe. What the hell? What? Just gets up? That sounds fair. Come on. Die. So it doesn't work. Okay, whatever. There has to be another DNA around here somewhere. I don't want to have to kill these guys over and over. What I guess is the only way to do it. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, snap. Okay. See, I can't even see them. That's real nice. I can't even see them. Okay, now I can see them. Extract them all. Let's all get their DNA. So, yeah, it's, it's basic concept. It's really not complicated at all. It's very fun. It's very enjoyable. You know, right now it's off to a slow start because it is just a the first chapter but it does get a lot more interesting as the game does go on and should I even mention the second game which is oh, fantastic second game was amazing anal probe all right so we got all the DNA we needed oh Okay, you know what? There you go, you can leave. So yeah, if any of you actually get interested in this game, you can actually purchase it on the PlayStation Store. Just look under PS2 for PS4, and it should be right there. Oh, I can't take a hard landing, apparently. So yeah, you get a freaking gray alien with a freaking jetpack. Check that out, he flies, man. He flies! And I took another hard landing. Okay, okay, you can probe too. You can get probe too. Just for fun. Or whatever, I'll take your brains too. Alright. Alright, so we can get to the saucer. Oh my god, how many of you guys are still here? See, that farmer didn't even see it coming. He's just chilling. Okay, Martha, I'll spare you. Just cause, But then there's so many of you, so do you really need to live? Okay. And to the saucer. And I think this will conclude the first part of the day. First part of this series. Excitement, man. Excitement. So I just wanted to kind of show around like how the game is. Talk about it and all that. And uh, next part, I'll try to be a little bit more straightforward. So, yeah. Wait, what was it? What, what's happening? Uh, I had to land it again. Oh, I think there was an option to go to the mothership and not just... Um, the saucer, so let's check that out. Uh, where is it? What? What? <sighs> let's go through this animation again. Fantastic. <laughs> but it is pretty cool animation, so I can't argue with that. Uh, return to the mothership. Didn't they say? Re wait, wait, wait! I think they have objectives. Oh, okay. I think you could just go back. I think. 
Let's hope so. Saving data. Cool. New mission available. Sweet. Now then, I know what you're thinking. What can I, a lowly novice, do to help bring about the destruction of Earth and the inevitable reign of the Furon Empire? <sighs> well, I'll tell you. It was in the earliest days of the Empire we realized our species was doomed. Eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes. We could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia. <laughs> Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and nubile. Sailors on a foreign planet, letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. Oh. Over the eons, we've learned to clone ourselves, but with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are This is a lot of dialogue. <laughs> the Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, <laughs> uncorrupted. They represent the future of the Furon race. If only we can get at them. There we go. So, that is it, you guys. This is a uh, part one. This is uh, of the Destroy All Humans gameplay. We're going to be doing all the missions. And it should be a fun time from here. So, you know what? Hopefully you guys will join me for the next one. Hope you guys will have a great day. Uh... Also, check out my other content if you guys haven't done that already. Hopefully, we get some new people in the channel. And check out my new channel art. All the new channel art. Also, hopefully, you guys do like the new layout that I put out for my webcam. I think it's really cool. I think I like. I really like how it came out. It kind of fits this new theme. And, of course, it fits my fetish of neon. So, <laughs> But, yeah, once again, hopefully, you guys will have a great day. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next one. Take care, you guys.